Hello and welcome back to our Microsoft Flight Simulator 24 career as we attempt to go from digital farmer to digital pilot. Over the last few episodes we have acquired our private pilot's license, our PPL, and we are qualified to do free flights so we can and first flights, sorry, so we can do that. We can even take people for um, sightseeing trips and stuff like that. So we need to get our level up to level 3 and I think that's going to take us another two or three um, missions to do that. And then we can go and try and get our certification for commercial pilot's license, which I don't even think we're ready for. I don't think we're even close to uh, to being able to do that. Um, but let's go in for some more missions. We've had some issues with landing lately. Here's all the first flight missions available right now. Take your pick which one you want to tackle next. Yeah, Landon has been a bit of an issue. We come in a little bit hot. So if if that continues to happen for the next two, say two um, flights, then um, we'll go back, we'll go to the training, and we'll, we'll see if we can work <laughs> our Landon a little bit better. So we have got... What's this one down here? What's that little symbol for? What's that for? Hmm, I don't know. Right, so we've got some more sightseeing um, with Sarah. Where's that for us flying out of Rundle? So that looks like a straight back and forth. I'm not sure if we come in if we can see any more of that at all. We'll see. We'll see what that one is. I think we can go with that. We'll try that one. Sarah Barlow and her daughter have never had the opportunity to fly on a private plane before. Share your passion for aviation with them by taking for a flight. Oh, so are we coming out of Norwich still? So we go Norwich to Ratcliffe and back again. So our, cl our client is Sarah Cohen, the flight coordinator. I think that's Sarah who's on the radio to us. And so there's a possible 17,000. So if we uh, actually ace this, we could go for our, our, <laughs> our private license thing, uh, our commercial license. We could get paid. So, yeah, no pressure. I, th I think we're not there yet. Sightseeing quality, flight smoothness, and then landing smoothness. Let's uh, let's um, have a little look at what we've got. So this is the flight path. This looks better than what we had before, actually. I just need to make sure, I, when, by the time I'm hitting base, I need to be slow, slowing down. I think that was sort of our, our issue before, really coming in way too hot yeah there's lots we can do here I think as we as we progress through we'll uh, we'll go through more of that I think the problem is at the minute my knowledge on what to do is further ahead than <laughs> my physical ability to do it so yeah let's 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 go fly So again, we will need to uh, set the plane up ready. Again, a mixture of controller and uh, keyboard and mouse. All these off. Move our chops, duck under the wing. Mind your head. Slither in the plane. Pause system test. Okay. Good. Everything's good. Everything's running well. We shall uh, request boarding. Ready for boarding, Sarah. Come on, Sarah, you come. Okay, on their way. Oh, someone else is uh, on the radio. Obviously, if Sarah's in the plane, we've got someone else on the radio. Didn't sound like Scott, though. Both in the back. Sarah doesn't look happy. So again, we'll uh, we'll use the, uh, the easy start procedure. This is the moment to make some smiles happen. Oh, in it, Jess. Captain, please welcome aboard Sarah and her daughter. We know them well here and wanted to treat them to a flight over their place for a while. If the seatbelts are fastened, you're ready for takeoff. I'm pretty Captain, sure. Captain, give it that a is shot. The same person. Captain, give it a shot. Less taxi. Just, uh, just turn my uh, navigation on. Coltishall traffic FERQ 83 Foxtrot Yankee Yankee 5612 is taxiing to runway 22. 
think that's what I want. And we will Hi, just Captain. set our head in. I'm Sarah. Can't wait to be looking down at my hometown. Hey, I'm Lucy, Sarah's daughter. Pleasure to meet you. The uh, pleasure's all mine. All mine. Right, so we're just going to get some juice of the engine. Try and get ourselves going. I've got quite a trip to the uh, stop and hold, so uh, I'll see you guys at stop and hold. So if we announce our takeoff. Call to shop traffic, going? FERQ 83 Foxtrot Yankee Yankee 5612, taking off runway 22 south departure. Coming out of Coltishall, we are ready, ready. Enter the runway. This used to be a military airbase. We're back up to speed. And there we go, finally moving. Try not to come in like a madman again, like we did last time. Right, we are clear for takeoff. Let's try and get ourselves on the centre line. Not far out. We got to do my flaps again, didn't I? And my trim. I said I need to remember. We got straight away. The trouble is, the trim is also on my right stick for looking I will get there I could get used to this but yeah what I need to do is do it with this there we go I'm not sure if we're going to get the uh, the helpful gates on this. We'll just follow the the GPS for now. So take the flaps off. Oh, the gates are there now. Don't sink. Don't sink. Don't sink. That's just the system registering the terrain below us, I think. So we'll try and do this nice and smooth. We feel really safe. Sarah was right. There's no sense of vertigo at all. Yeah, absolute boss of a captain, that's why. Let's maybe bring some engine speed down, add a little bit more trim. I don't want to bring that down to 2300. We are a little bit high. So if we sink below Maybe the you'll spot your school or the places where you used to play when you were kids. Yeah, would be quite a flight. Out at Rackheath, wouldn't it just? So getting a lot of lift. So I'm sure this Quick. was super smooth. A photo. Let's slow down for you. I do that. So are we circling Racky when we get there? Or are we coming back? I see Racky. 
We've got a clear view of everything from here. I love it. Yes. It's great seeing the world from this angle. From above. So we are we are gonna lower engine speeds. I'm gonna put on some more trim. Oh, I took away trim. Engine power down. Hopefully we'll slow down. Come on, a little bit slower. We're going too fast to appreciate it all. If I slow the engine down any more, we'll uh, drop out the sky, sweetheart. This is only our third flight in Korea, so yeah, you know, give man a break. Now we're going super slow. Stall. I'm sure that filled up my confidence. Stall. 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 Hopefully the uh, the passengers don't hear that. I didn't expect us to be flying this low. We're missing the best part of the view. Sweetheart, you're like a few feet. A few feet below is all it was. I think that went all right, despite the moaning. Ungrateful buggers. <laughs> so we'll try and uh, contact. Trying to announce my position, it's not. There we go. Cold to traffic, FERQ 83 Foxtrot, Yankee Yankee 56125 miles south, 1300 feet inbound to land runway 2. A little bit, bit, bit jolty and janky. When we took off, I thought there should have been a drum roll or something. Well, just because we uh, didn't die, we should wait for the landing. Wait for the landing, Lil. Drum roll on that one. Coming in way too quick again. Really am having issues getting this to hold hold the horizon, unfortunately. Which is annoying because when I do my free flights and stuff, I don't have this issue. That's just my nervous thumbs because I know I'm being recorded. Almost there, guys. So Sarah having a good time? Ready for another round? So exhilarating. Quite an experience. I recommend it. Not five stars? No star rating today? I'm going to get the trim to about 10 or 11 if I can. Yeah, the gates are a little bit off with the uh, the GPS at the minute, but 
excuse me while I tilt my head, I cannot help but do that. Right, so if we level ourselves out a little bit. A little bit of trim. A little engine power. I just like my approach pattern to be a little bit, a little bit longer. Give me time to do stuff. We need some longer flights so I can set up my autopilot. So now we need to start our descent. As we come around, so we need to start slowing down. So I think if we can. Oh, he's got to tell us off for that. Hey, it's shaking. That's just me, girl. Don't you worry. That's normal. Again, she's coming in way too quick again. Five hundred. Gonna put me uh, flaps up now. Yeah, we have flaps now. I think we're supposed to be coming in probably around about 65, 70 knots, really. So we'll nose up, we'll nose up. A little bit much. That landing, scary stuff. What did I not do? Did I forget to announce? I noticed there was something on the communications that went red. What was wrong with that landing? That was all right. <laughs> now, please, anyone. She obviously doesn't know the rule. <laughs> Any landing you walk away from is a good one. Let's get down this runway. Yeah, that was shakier than the last one, that flight. Just a shame. Yeah, I need to uh, put some work in on the landing, I think. Go back to school, do some training, brush up on it. The only thing is that when you do the training for the land and they have you set up perfectly coming in, normally in a straight line, uh, you don't have to do the whole getting ready thing. Run a bit quick for taxiing. And I'm going to miss my box. I think I missed the box on the way out as well. Uh, this is not good. Coltishall Traffic FARQ 83 Foxtrot <laughs> Yankee Yankee 5 612 is taxiing to parking. You alright? This is how we do it. Don't you worry, love. Don't you worry. Now we've got to get us moving to get off the brass. <laughs> Come on. I think once you're down, obviously your, your rating part is done. So. They don't tend to say much. Once they're down. I'm not even sure if you can actually fly out of RAF Collishall anymore. It's not RAF anymore, it's just Collishall. I'm not even sure if you can. I know a large part of what's out here and the barracks and stuff 
a lot of that was converted for <laughs> prisoners and asylum seekers. What a mix. There was at one point talk of building a prison on here. I don't think that ever happened. They just used the, the barracks to, to house. But yeah, we need, definitely need some more time. <laughs> more time in the simulator to uh, perfect that land. And, and I, need, I need to remember to set my flaps and my trim before takeoff. We need to have that ready. It's just going to get us that lift so we're, we're, we're climbing a little bit better. I think we will. I think today we'll do two flights. I think we'll have another flight today. Let's see what we can do. I believe you've got what it takes to bounce back and make it right. Do you? Yeah. I'm sure our guests had a thrill over their whole region anyway. Of course they did. No one died again, so that's a success. Every flight we get through where everyone survives is a win. Oh dear, oh dear. Flaps extended at max speed, that's what got me last time. We made it to B. We got a B rating. Uh, we are a B, a B rating pilot. We are not top of the class. Not top of the class at all. Little spike in our reputation, man. We want that above B. We want that above B. Okay. We are now level three, but we are not ready. <laughs> not ready in the slightest to uh, to try and take you that. You built up enough flight hours to be eligible to take your CPL. We're not there. We are if not you there. pass your CPL, you can begin to get paid for successful missions. We are not. So we have a little look. We click on it. So, things that we need to get on point is trim management, which I'm struggling with because on the because I'm on the controller, and everything feels a bit rushed because they're such short flights. But I'm trying to do it really quickly, and it's it's moving my camera instead of moving the trim. And if I move the camera and look down, I have trouble maintaining altitude and and um, sort of navigation. Departure. Um, dead Reckoning, which I actually quite enjoy. Landmark navigating. Arrivals. First solo navigation. So I like this training, despite not being very good at it. Um, but we... That take all of our money. So I think it's like an easy pass to get you in there. Um, because if you fail, you, you're done. You have to start over. But I think what I'd like to do is just take another... Free flight out over Deerham. So it's coming out of Swanton Morley. Over Deerham to Matishall. I think I might take I might take that. 30 minute flight. So let's have a look at what's got us down for. So our departure. This is a oh. <laughs> okay, that is um, quite the pattern you've got me on there. So we've got to come out, cross halfway across the field, back out, do the sight, see if we come back, we cross the airfield again, but across, get into formation, and land. This is a tiny airport, so yeah, we'll, we'll see, we can see what we can do. Um, Peter Horoff and his sister are ready to hit the skies with you. If you're up for it, uh, you can take them over to Hiram. Where, where's our flight plan? Over here. So, yeah. Quite a one, that one. We'll give it a try. We'll give it a crack. Let's go. So, sightseeing, smoothness, and land. So, it's the same thing again, same scoring markers. And we're going 20,000 meters. Not very far. I'd say 30 minute flight. Oh, yeah, we're ready. We got this. Is this a grass airfield as well? Oh, mate. Lieutenant Dan, you ain't got no legs. We got no legs, Lieutenant Dan. 
Sorry. Um, everything's bouncing in. <laughs> everything's bouncing in. So, okay, no, no actual tarmac. Let's get that off. Chocks away. There we go. Right, request boarding. Everything's ready, James. You can initiate boarding. Roger that. Oh, plane bounced in as well. Roger, roger. Excellent stuff. Oh, in the front, sweetheart. You cannot touch any of the buttons. We don't know what they do yet. Uh, so we shall complete start our procedure. This is the moment to make some smiles happen. On board. You're taking one of our friends, Peter, and his sibling for a nice scenic ride over the region. Is everyone seated and have their seat belts fastened? Excellent. You're good to go then. Let's do it. So we'll go. Hmm. I'll, I'll leave the heading for now. I think we're just going to be doing too much. This this is such a short part. I don't worry about down the heading. Things. I'll bring that up on there. They can uh, see what's happening. Where are we going? Try not to touch any buttons. Same as I never. Oh, we should have our strobe on. We should probably have our navigation lights on. We should definitely have our taxi lights on. Okay, we're on the ground. You should always have your landing lights on. And we should have our beacon on. Fuel pump's fine. Pilot heating, cabin power. Yeah. So, before we go this time, set my flaps. And, down here, we'll set the trim to 12, because it looks by each roll of the mouse. It's like by 3. So we'll set it to 12. Right. Let's go. Uniform Kilo Zero, 7 Traffic FARQ, 83 Hotel, My Golf 2114 is taxiing to runway 5. We'll find out where this runway is. So happy to be flying with you today. Captain, I'm Peter. Hey Last there, day, I'm Elizabeth. Hey, right, it's so great hanging out with you today. No offense, you said By hanging out, young. I mean flying. What's going on with the plane? What is going on with the plane? And, um, yeah, we're not, <laughs> not going to taxi through the trees. Let's not do this to me. The plane's got stuck. It's going to take a bit more juice to get us anywhere. Ready to take off. Uniform Kilo Zero Seven Traffic FARQ Eighty Three Hotel My Golf Two One One Four taking off runway five south departure. Might have to use the uh, ailerons as well to help us turn a little bit here. This is our runway up ahead. Slow down a little bit again. Out in a farmer's field for this one. So I think once we get down here, we have to turn around. So, so we're driving down to the end of the uh, the runway. And then hopefully, hopefully I'll be able to turn the plane around. And then we'll go up, up the runway. Let's take off. Does not like moving on the grass. 
Yeah, it make a U sound, so I thought. Which is always so easy to do in a plane. Obviously. Alright, hold on to your hats, people. Let's go, let's give it some beans. I'm not sure if I'm liking the weather. I'm not I'm not confident in this in this weather. There we go. There we go. We're up. I get used to this. Just you wait, mate. Just you wait. You'll be more than done with it in time. Take a left. Might cut back on the engine already, I think. What's that weird jolt? Are we going down? No, we're not going down at all, mate. We're actually going up. We are ascending. Back on the throttle a little bit. It is windy. Hey, this, this weather is not for me. Not if I've got to come back and land land in that field. Oh dear. A bird just flew past, and I wanted to wave to him. Okay. You can do that, buddy. No one will judge. What's with the turbulence? Should I be it's, worried? No, it's just weather, mate. It's just weather. It's just a bit windy today. Got many control that, I'm afraid. So you, the sky is mind blowing. Left. Seeing it from up here is even better. I might have got poor rain soon by the looks of it, so. So we're now heading out to Matchall. Hey sis, I'm sure we'll see places we know. It's gonna be awesome. So sure thing. Sick, mate. Absolutely sick. You're gonna love it. Uh, what we need to do is uh, take off the flat. I knew I pressed the wrong direction. Oh. That's because I wanted to reduce flaps, but to reduce flaps is up. To add flaps is down. Keep getting it wrong and it's gonna down mark us every time. I need to find out James where was right. I don't feel afraid or dizzy. No, you shouldn't feel afraid or dizzy, mate. We're just chilling. Chilling up here in the clouds. It's all good, buddy. It's all good. Don't you worry. It's so quiet up here. So peaceful. It's not bad. The 
don't mind me, I'm just trying to familiarise myself with things. Relax, Peter. You're gripping the seat so hard you're going to break your hand. Why is he doing that for? Awesome. I see the roofs. Look over there. It's amazing. I recognize everything down there. Me too. Start to slow down. Start to try and add some trim. I'm taking it away again. Slow down. In the free fall. I want to slow the flight down. Come on, slow down. Slow down. There we go. I find it really challenging to get this... Either to get the plane to stay in the air or just to slow down for me. Hey, I can see your child at school. Oh, wow. I see that too. That's awesome. I didn't expect to spot that so easily. So will it let me... Call me corny, but I'll treasure this memory with you all my life. Use flaps now, yeah. So we can use our flaps now because we're going so slow and slow. Going way too slow for my liking. Bit more throttle. If oh. we're higher up, we'd have a wider point of view. Oh, Just mate. Saying. Stall, 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 stall. We're not stalling. We're fine. We're stall. fine. We're fine. Stall. We're fine. Stall. Stall. Can we fly stall. higher, Captain? We're too Man. low to take good pictures. What are you talking about, mate? Stall. This is perfect height. Sometimes it's only a matter of feet and they grumble. Let's go. I should get back in my tractor, that's what I should do. I've got to be careful, we're going to start speeding up too much now. They'll complain he can't see anything. Right. Let's announce our position to whoever's standing in the field waiting for us. Uniform Kilo 07 Traffic FARQ 83 Hotel, Mike Golf 21, 145 miles, southeast 1,300 feet inbound to land runway 5. Take off the flat for now because we will end up coming in way too. Way too hot. I'm going to get towed off again. It's like the world is laid out in front of me. Well, that'll be because it is, my friend. I want to click the trim. It's going to rain at any point. Let's see if we can enter the pattern at around 2100. Help to keep the airspeed down. Although I think it's going to be a quick descent, isn't it? We 
one in a bit low. Welcome back, aviators. Oh, no, not too Are you bad. okay, Peter? Ready to give it a go again? So cool. Thanks. You made our day, Captain. You're quite welcome. We've got to land yet. We've got to try, try, try and work out this somewhat intricate approach. Keep it smooth, baby. By the way, feedback is uh, more than welcome in this series. Please, we need it. All the feedback. Quite a way off, and again the the GPS line, and we can see the GPS line is top left, obviously with our plane in it, but also here. So this is sort of the direction we're going. But the GPS line is actually over there, so we we should have that purple line in the middle of us, and then we'd be following the GPS line that's up there, and which well, should be on here, but for some reason is not carrying over with us. When we're flying at the minute, I'm not quite sure what that's about. Right, start to let off. I wonder if I can put my flaps on now. Because that'll help keep us up, cause drag, slow us down. I'm hoping. As we coast in. Such a tight turn. So I'm not even sure if our gates are taking us anywhere for our, our GPS markers. We'll get there. It's a little less bumpy, but still feels like I'm on a roller coaster. Shush your lips, mate. I can make it worse. A lot worse. Got to land in that field yet? Yeah, I feel like somehow maybe I've crossed into the wrong gates. I don't know. There we go. We're all good. We're following the pattern. No one's told us off, so we must be doing something. Not even sure <laughs> what bit is the runway. Where is the runway? Is it that weavy bit? Not liking the look of that, I must say. Again, I think by the time we hit final approach again, we're gonna be coming in way too way too quick. Way too quick. Oh, trim's the wrong way. There we go. A bit more trim. So we're coming in on final approach. Announce. Down there somewhere. Uniform Kilo 07 traffic FARQ 83 Hotel, my Golf 2114 is on final runway 5 to land. Where the hell is the runway? Which bit is it? Please and thank you. Lord knows. A 
wheel out the runway. This right? landing was savage. It's is that the right, right word? No, it's not the right word. Successful. The word you're after is successful. This landing was successful. And the taxi. Yeah. Do you, want, do you want more of these green fields, please? Never mind. Again, though, we're down and no one died. I need to try and get myself some tarmac. <laughs> oh, dear. We definitely, we're definitely going to go off and do some um, land and practice. Remember, I do the land and practice as an episode and then try and go for our next certification or what I don't know I need to just put some paint down so you know where you're going there's someone with some <laughs> a roller just go down there and mark up the bit that I'm allowed to stay in and not wheel out of Runway, mate. It's a field. Now we got stuck on a hill. Oh come on! This is ridiculous. This plane doesn't like going. By the way. I go. believe you've got what it takes to bounce back and make it right. I'm sure our guests <laughs> had a me. thrill over their home region anyway. I bet they did. It was it was good. I don't know why everyone's always get their panties in a such a twist. <laughs> Shut the plane down. All good. That was all right. Considering I didn't know where the runway was, I think we did all right to get that down. I think it'd be perfect in an emergency. Radio communications, runway excursions, flaps extended at maximum speed by accident again. No skip bonus. Bad. Oh, I got a bonus for bad weather. Oh, what did they? I was able to fly in bad weather. And you get a bonus for not skipping any sectors. So that's, that's what's sort of getting me through at the minute. Not skipping. Has that helped us at all in our reputation? I don't think it has. I, I, I think we stayed put. Maybe went up about two percent, and that was it. We're now level four, though. But we are gonna eventually. We're gonna get the highest level, and still be doing um, free flights because we're so bad. But that is it for another episode on our journey to becoming a master pilot. I'd, I'd be, I'd be happy with a. That reputation of B. If we could become a B-rated pilot, that would be epic. Hopefully you've enjoyed this one. I'm having a lot of fun with this game. I'm, I'm absolutely loving it. Um, hopefully you're enjoying coming along with me. Let me know in the comments whether you want me to take me out of the video or keep me in the video or what have you. I, I'm not really fussed. But yeah, what do you what do you prefer? Yeah, if you've liked this one, give it a big fat thumbs up down below. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, turn the bell notification on, find out when new videos are going live. As always, comments and feedback down there. You guys have a wonderful day, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.